We have a problem. What is it? Mr. Pickles is getting ready to cancel Slogo. Oh my god, that's true. I heard the story about that. So, uh, we're gonna be watching it. We're on, already on, starting on Josh Robert. Oh, oh my god, man. dude. I don't know why he's doing this. Oh, we're gonna be reacting to it and, uh, well, give our thoughts. Robert Temple, also known online as Slogo or Slogo Man, has claimed that he can never be cancelled. Is no. Yeah, let me do this. Is this real though, or is Slogo brainwashing his viewers to forget about his disturbing past? Today, me and my good friend Brian Stuff are going to be finding evidence to set an end to this and cancel Slogo for good. To start off with this intense investigation, I headed over to the app that causes the most drama. Yes, it's Twitter. And let's just say that you'd probably be surprised with how much evidence is on here. Check out this photo on your screen. Seems normal, right? Well, it's actually not normal. I'll give you five seconds to take a look at it. I mean, he looks perfectly fine. He's trying to support board game. Mr. Pickles, why? I... I'm like really pissed off right now at this guy. Found anything? If not, then let me show you. We can see that Josh has reposted another post on Twitter with a really cute dog in it with Bork in the background. But this cute dog and this bold text is trying to distract you from what's really going on here. We can see that Josh has captioned his post, Bork Gang for life. By this, we now already know that Josh is in a gang called Bork Gang, and he's trying to say that Bork Gang is the best. This means that other gangs will try to attack Bork Gang to prove about gang members he's talking about to support the merch support the team mr pickle why are you making them full story the best this is all false that you're doing mr pickles it's time that your channel and your views should be removed I recently hacked into Slogo's PC to see if I could find any evidence and take a look at this. Yo Bork, are you ready to walk down to the hood and shoot up Humpy Crew with our legendary scars? I cannot let my viewers find out in secret Okay, about that, that sounds like Slogo AI. Yeah, it sounded like he used an AI off of CapCut. No, it's not that. We there's this app called Character AI. It has Slogo's voice and Crano's voice. So basically, Craner, I mean, Mr. Pickles, is using character AI and tech to ask the character AI of Slogo to copy where he said, and that's what Mr. Pickles is doing. So I know what you're up to, Mr. Pickles. I think it's time for you to get canceled. It's time to expose Mr. Pickles. Uh, let's the gang member. Confirming that Joshua Robert Temple's Slogo is promoting gang violence to his younger audience. Moving on to more evidence, have you seen the way Slogo treats Craner in Cherry Island? Let me explain for a second. Okay, again, Cherry Island is Slogo's world. Slogo created that world, that is his world. He could to choose what to do with it. And Craner, he's just a member of his world, a part of the member. So there's no point of you in saying that Slogo is just being bully. I mean, like Slogo said, that's his actual world. He created that, and the uh, Craner is just a knight. But I don't know. I don't see what's the problem here. So quit trying to cancel other YouTubers' channel. Just leave them be. Logo builds this big beautiful castle, invites Craner to work for him by giving him a special outfit, then makes Craner do all of these chores and only do work for Slogo that benefit. Oh my god, the not chores, they're tasks. If you wanted the castle done, you gotta do the task, and that he has to follow by the rules for just doing a wolf play. Craner decides to move out and build himself a castle, a sand castle to beat Bork Gang. And Humpy Crew is trying to go out there, but they, but they both capture each other's pets. So, who's really, they're in the war right now. 
So they're not bullying each other. Fit Slogo himself. And while Craner is working hard, Slogo thinks it's not good enough and tortures him. It gets so bad that Craner retires and then Slogo steals his pet? What we can straight away see here is a big sign of slavery. Slavery against Craner. I mean, Josh. Okay, 